So guys, we're about to start off with Chapter 4 of As Dusk Falls. Now, welcome back for more of it. We're only, what, Part 6 of the Campaign Series story. Thank you guys so much, man. I've really been enjoying this game so far. Uh, very surprising. Um, it's kind of like me treating as a query plus a Telltale series, you know, all those type of games that it's kind of like the options where you get to choose. Pretty much like your own option, what to say, who lives, who dies, you know. So you got to be very cautious with that. So, but um, enjoying it so far. Thank you guys so much for joining me. And yeah, right here, continue where we left off. Let's do it, guys. I'm going to go just kind of be scrolling down the menu with you guys. Here we go. Uh, skip ball. All right, let's do it, man. I've been excited for that, man. After that, I would say kind of like cliffhanger on the last part, man. Kind of me thinking like, you know what? Let's do it. All right, guys. I love you all. Let's continue where we left off. Before I started going to the pool, I used to run. 5Ks, 10Ks, it didn't matter. Not how fast I sprinted, not whether I came in first. It was like trying to outrun my own shadow. But it's not my shadow I'm running from now. It's his. And he was running long before I was. I said turn off the engine! was a getaway. Bad news. Step on it, Jay! see a thing out there. That's the idea. Cut the engine. Christ, I can't believe this. <sighs> We're alive. That's something, at least. You get the we're dumb for, right? We could still go to the cabin. How? On a magic carpet? Half the damn state's looking for us. And if anyone knows it's there... Cops will be halfway to Devil's Gulch before they realize they're not following us. The cabin's off-grid. Bear never told a soul about the place. We don't know that for sure. It's a huge risk. Well, Jesus, Tyler, we gotta go somewhere. Uh, I'm gonna say we stop arguing, man. We're in a tough situation right now. Guys, I don't think this is helping. Hey! hey! Look, you got away. Can you let me go now? Shut up. Rob the sheriff, bust to Mexico. Fuck, Ma. <laughs> All we do is cover up one mistake with the next one. We left Dale lying there. We just... We just left him. Why don't we talk in private? Keep an eye on him. I know none of this has gone like we planned. And what happened? Hey, oh, unlock the door. The what? No, I can't. Right Come now, on, man. This could be my only chance. If Tyler sees you, he won't if you hurry. What Come on. Please. Oh, man. I don't want to do that. I don't know, man. With Vince, I feel like there's a chance if he actually ends up me. I mean, for me, I'll, if I unlock it. So I'm going to leave it locked. I'm going to keep it safe. I'm sorry. I can't. <sighs> mm. 
Oh no! Stop! Get yourself shot! Oh no! Jesus! A right hook too. He giving you trouble? I took care of it. We're heading for the cabin. We'll be safe about it. Mm -hmm. Let's hit the highway before that chopper circles back. So there was a chance for me if I would still leave it unlocked if I didn't fight for it, or? You sure Pa didn't tell anyone the cabin's there? Barely told me about it. I guess the motorcycle's there. And the food. See? Now you're looking on the bright side. It's weird that I look at my monitor for one second. Next thing I think there was a cow in the way, or I don't know what just happened. I can't get them out! They're gonna die in there! Hey, you hear that? Oh, fuck! They found us! We gotta leave them! Go, go, go! Vince? Come on. Not now. Uh, just stay calm. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, man. If I wouldn't have locked him, man, he would have been safe. Um, What else can we search for? Well, first we gotta unbuckle it, right? Oh, Lord. You gotta be kidding me. Let's see here. I can't reach it. Let's see under the seats. <laughs> Can we look anything back there? No. this little twist there with the screwdriver. Oh, come on, come on. I didn't give it no time limit. I don't know why I had to rapidly press A. Wake up. Hey, you gotta wake up. No way. Oh, God. No. Wait, what? Wait. Are you serious? I don't believe that. That is insane. I am actually absolutely shocked right Ma! now. Tyler! Hey, I think I saw someone run. Book two expansion. All right. I don't know why it says book two. It's kind of weird. I wonder if this is an actual book, though. I'm kind of curious about it. I have to look it up. I'm actually surprised with Vince. I mean, so here's the thing. If I would have unlocked it, would he been dead anyways? I don't know. I have to look into it, though. What if he died, regardless? If or... goes bad, all a man can do is put it down.
knew he shouldn't have brought him. Hey. Let's go out to the cabin and get high. Where is it? Oh, why can't I find it? The, the cabin. Hey. I think I need water. Somewhere at the edge of the world lies the lost fortress of awesomeness. All those who seek it have perished. All except one fearless young adventurer. His name, Ash Willema. Famed for his courage, his honor, and his, uh, his... Hmm. Attractiveness. I love that. Uh, I'm gonna go resourcefulness. That's a resource resourcefulness. His talent for overcoming problems. And this is the story of his quest. No. Two months earlier. Wow, we're way off. <laughs> Look, Shima, I drew the story about the fort. You know, the one Ryan saw in the forest? There are no forts in Arizona. He's making it up. No, it's true. He was out hiking with his dad, out by the ridge. There's a rock shaped like a shark's tooth. That's where they saw it. Mm-hmm. I was thinking, wouldn't it be awesome if we went looking for it, too? We could camp out for the night and, uh, I don't know, do other cool stuff, like, uh, like... Watch the stars, tie a rope swing, make a campfire. Why not, right? We could light a fire and roast marshmallows. Mmm. Now, if you want to get outdoors, why don't you go ride your bike? And while you're at it, go get the mail. Besides, we can't this weekend because Because I... you're busy, like always. I bet my dad would have gone with me. You have no idea what kind of man your father turned out to be. All right. If you say so, whatever. Hey, buddy, you be careful on that road now. It'll be dark soon and you ain't got lights. Go get the mail, Ash. Screw this. Oh, it just took off. It's hot desert, man. Jesus. Woohoo! Uh oh. Thunderstorms ahead. Climbing to 30,000 feet. <sighs> oh, Lord. I thought had his, his eyes closed there for a second. Gotta watch up, out, kid. There you go. So I believe Joyce, I think that's her son, I believe. Awesome piloting skills. And now the quest continues on foot. Active hunting er, uh, area. Oh, no. Yo, so much has happened right now, man. Huh. This series in general. No, this this can't be right. Ah, oh, mom. If you'd come with me, we could have found it by now.
gotta be something I can eat. Come to Ash. Oh man. Okay, so I really save it for sure. I'll save it. I have a feeling some wild animal is gonna come at him. I, I don't can know. Wait. Definitely. Sure, I can. I don't know. Some wild animal comes, man. Like, Hello? hey, I got a treat for you, sir. Oh lord. Oh my god. What the hell? Get out of there. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Ooh. Oh crap. Oh man, act scary. No, don't. I mean, if I run, I don't know what happens. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the candy. Should I do that? Speak calmly. I don't want to do that. Throw the candy. Why not, right? Here you go. Please. Let's take it. Please. There you go. Well, hopefully. Okay, good. Woo. I was getting myself nervous there for a second. It's a good thing I saved it, man. Except the ash is starving. Jesus. Out by the ridge, near a rock shaped like a shark's tooth. No way. <laughs> Gotta get water. Gotta get warm. All right, I'm happy I saved that candy, by the way. Uh, let's go search here first. Otherwise, that boar would have eaten me alive. I don't know. I my own arm right now. It's a good thing, man, we find all this. Oh, man. What in the world? Uh. Um, drink water, definitely, right? You gotta stay hydrated. Please let there be a medicine cabinet. Oh yeah. I see it up there, buddy. Hurry it up. Let's see what we got here. 15 seconds. Alright. A pad painkillers. Is there anything else? Cough medicine. Little pads to cover up the. What do you even do with this? Oh, wait a minute, wait. What's the news? Hate to say it, but we've lost them in the woods. <sighs> Send out search parties. And notify local radio stations. I want everyone in the country knowing the name Halt. Roger that. <sighs> the Halts. Think we're gonna catch them? I'd say 50-50. The next 24 hours are critical. So it just depends on how smart they are. So we're not 
motel right now. Child, uh, what is that? Childhood photos? We got like a backpack. Let's take a look at backpack first. That's it his? I don't think so, right? No? Okay. Ha! It's just like, okay. You can search somewhere else now. Uh, childhood uh, photos. I'm gonna save the window for last. Can I have my phone on? Hit my phone on my desk. I don't know if you guys heard that. I should stay inside. Um, there's more to search, really. Oh, the family portrait. That's what we got here. Alright then. I kind of figured that would happen. Letter, really. I didn't see a lot earlier. All right, um, Mr. Moreland, Vanessa was caught smoking again this week. If it happens again, she'll be suspended. Please remind all teachers, especially to those language. Okay. Okay. So it's kind of like a... Someone got in trouble or something, like, like the daughter or some. <gasps> That's the Woodman's Cottage. It was my mom's, so... Don't drop it. Are you the one who found me? You're in pretty rough shape. You got babbling about some cabin or something. Are you lost? No. I... Uh, I got hit by a car. Where? In the forest? On the highway. I must have hit my head and wondered. Oh. Wow. Well, maybe I should call 911. I'd drive you to the hospital, but I'm not supposed to use a car. No. Um, can't afford it. Necessity. Uh, can't afford it. My family. We can't afford medical bills. Well, don't you have insurance? I mean, yeah. But you know how it is. They still make you pay more than you can. Well, I'm glad you're alive. I wasn't sure for a while there. Are you okay? You went to Two Rock High, right? I, uh, yeah. The high school. I went for a while. Thought so. You used to eat lunch alone under that gnarly tree by the parking lot, right? The juniper. Yeah, that was me. Tell me your name again. It's Dean. Hey, Dean. I'm Vanessa. Look, could I rest here a while? My head, it's... I'll stay out of the way, I promise. Mm. Well, I guess I don't mind the company. But you have to be gone before eight, or my dad will kill us both. And just so we're clear, I once kicked a guy in the nuts so hard he swallowed his own tongue. <laughs> Good to know. Here. These are old, but they're clean. Thank you. <laughs> so, why'd you leave TRH? You got sick of Mrs. Campbell always sending everyone to detention? Nah. I dropped out. That makes two of us, by the way. I mean, technically, I was pulled out so I could go to a lame Catholic school and be told what to wear and what to think, but... What was your excuse? Don't have the... Don't have to after 6. Or 16. Prefer the outdoors. Uh, I prefer the outdoors, for sure. I didn't like being stuck inside all day. Well, what about Jim? They kept trying to teach me basketball. On that indoor court where the AC always breaks? Yeah. See? Much better. BB, where's my sandwich? I'll be right there. Who was that? Oh, it's just my Mima. Are you hungry? I don't know if she meant grandma or her mom or... You're going to behave yourself today, right, Mima? Okay. Hang on, I forgot my cigarettes. You haven't smoked in years. Haven't I? 
Nope. We have some new developments in what police are now calling the Desert Dream Massacre. We knew one of the shooters was killed at the scene, but it's been confirmed. Three more are still on the loose. You okay with ham and cheese? Oh, none of those disgusting sliced singles. The gunman who died was identified as Dale Holt of Two Rock, who had a prior conviction for assault. Um, leave it on. There's speculation the other suspects are members of the same family. Mima, we have a visitor. Um, hello there. Hang on, I know that voice. Huh? Oh, Lord Almighty, you're home. Is it really you, Maddie? Um, it's not. <laughs> I'm being honest here. I'm sorry, we've never met. My name's Dean. Oh. Maddie died, didn't he? Yes, Mima. The things a mind can forget. Here, let me help. <sighs> so, Dean, what does a high school dropout do all day? I'm not judging, I'm just jealous. So I hit my headset on my mic. <laughs> um, so I hop around the house? Just do chores, mostly. Take care of the yard. If my brothers are home, maybe we go to the dump and find something we can fix, you know? <laughs> sure. Who doesn't chill at the dump? Tell you one thing. Matthew made better sandwiches than him. I made your sandwich. And it tastes like cardboard. Because you won't let me use condiments. <sighs> I'm gonna go listen to murder, she wrote. <sighs> it was nice to meet you, Dave. She used to be my role model. She had a motorcycle license. She knew karate. Now she either can't find her pants or can't remember how to put them on. Matt. Matthew, he's your... My brother. <laughs> He died in a car accident. Um, that's what happened. If you don't mind me asking. How did it happen? Spring break? A year ago? Matt was grounded as usual. My dad's always grounding us. So, he snuck out to this party. Said I wouldn't have liked it. Though, I think he just wanted to keep me out of trouble. When he wasn't at breakfast the next morning, our dad was furious. And then we got the call. It happened on his way home. My brother died too. Kind of recent. How? He got shot. Fuck. That's... Ugh, that's horrible. I know. Look... Do you mind if I study for a little bit? Finals start next week, and I haven't opened a book all semester. Can I help clean up? Be my guest. You know, you were smart to drop out. I mean, do we really need to know three ways Andrew Jackson changed the US presidency? <laughs> Don't think so. If this comes up, I'm just gonna skip it. And washing dishes or dishes? <laughs> I don't know how to read right now. Or talk, I would say. So, were you close? Huh? To your brother. I know he's going to make me choose. Uh, he was a bully, mixed feelings. Yeah, looked out for me, for sure. He was always trying to protect me from things. Mm -hmm. From our older brother. From Pa. When he was on a bender. Your dad... He's a drunk or something? Was a drunk. Now he's fighting for his life in a VA hospital. Damn. Your luck's as bad as mine. What happened? I was going to drink my water there for a second, but I kind of knew I was going to make a choice here. Um, does it hang himself? He hung himself. Or 
tried to. I stopped him. Jesus, Dean. This is a, a horrible thing to say, but... Sometimes I wish my dad would die or whatever. Come on. You don't mean that. You'd understand if you knew him. He's a control freak. Family can't suck. Oh, could you run away? He can't be that bad. Come on. He can't be all that awful. Not in a nice house like this one. It's not that he's awful. He's just so... Uptight. Ugh. Anyway, sorry that got so dark. <sighs> hey, you want to help me study? Oh, I don't think I'll be much help. <sighs> yeah, you will. That's always better with someone else. Okay, sure. All right, guys. I uh, started for the weird uh, cuts. Finally, I got a got a chance to. At least make an outro for this one. So, but uh, thank you guys so much uh, for the supports. Uh, but to continue where we left off on the next video, if you guys want more of it, that is, just continue on chapter four uh, for this one. I love you all and take care.